Hi, and welcome to Frauscher Talks. My name is Michaela, and today we are going to look at how reliability, maintainability, and availability are calculated. Reliability calculations often include data on component failure rates, maintenance, environmental factors, and other relevant parameters. Here's an overview of some common reliability calculations. Mean time to failure, MTTF, represents the average time that the system or component is expected to operate without experiencing a failure under normal operating conditions. It provides insights into the reliability of the system or component over time. The higher the MTTF value, the more reliable the system is considered to be. Mean time between failures, MTBF, is the average time between consecutive failures of a system or component. It provides an indication of how often failures are expected to happen. MTTF is sometimes used interchangeably with MTBF. However, there's a small difference between the two. MTTF applies to non-repairable systems where failures lead to permanent damage or unfixable conditions. MTBF, on the other hand, applies to repairable systems where failed components can be restored and resume operation. For instance, with regards to Frausche products, the MTTF is used for wheel sensors and the MTBF is used for boards. Effective maintainability ensures that systems operate reliably and safely while minimizing downtime and maintenance costs. Here's how maintainability is calculated. MTBM stands for mean time between maintenance and represents the average time interval between successive maintenance actions. A higher MTBM value indicates longer intervals between maintenance activities. This suggests that the system or component can operate for longer periods without requiring maintenance. Mean time to maintain, MTTM, represents the average time required to perform planned maintenance on a system or component. A lower MTTM value indicates faster maintenance times and better use of maintenance resources. Mean repair time, MRT, provides insights into the average time it takes to restore a failed system or component to operational status after a failure happens. Similar to MTTR, a lower MRT value indicates faster repair times and better maintenance practices. However, in the railway industry, we also have to think and plan for the long term with regards to maintainability. We have to think about how our products that we sell to railway operators now can still be repaired and maintained in 20 or more years' time. We also have to consider if we will be able to offer a replacement that is functionally compatible. It is a huge challenge which can only be handled when considerations around maintainability are included into the product from the beginning. Reliability and maintainability play important roles in determining availability. Systems with high reliability and fast maintainability will therefore have higher availability. A stands for availability and this formula considers maintenance task, MTBM, and the time required for maintenance, MTTM, as well as the time between failures, MTBF, and the time required for repair, MRT. It provides the percentage of time the system or component is operational and available. In summary, reliability and maintainability are key factors that influence availability. By focusing on improving reliability and maintainability, organizations can enhance system availability, reduce downtime and improve operational performance. 
Thanks everyone for joining us once more and I hope you found this episode insightful. We will catch up in the upcoming episode of Rauscher Talks. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share.